Hello, this is Dustin with Home Mender, and today we're doing a throwback. Fence over chain link. I recently made a short video of this fence over chain link from years ago, and the attention that it got was hilarious. We're gonna follow up on this seven year fence over chain link. And I'm gonna show you how. Let's get to it. So with the decline of the viewer's attention span and the popularity of TikTok and YouTube shorts, I recently did the fence over into a short where I showed how to put a four x four over top of a chain link fence. Now for extra stability while I was building the fence, I zip tied it until the fence was built. But well, people ran Looking with good. it and took off. And just the comments that I received about the zip ties hundreds of commenters just waiting to insult the process thank you youtube for the silly face on me on the cover here of this video now this video has got 2.3 million views and 27,000 likes that's a lot of thumbs up and it's it's 10 times the thumbs down i think we got 2700 if you go to the comments, you can see there, there's so many slanderous remarks about hillbillies. I remember Kentucky being bad-mouthed in there, how redneck this is. And I don't mind you talking about the work and what you say. I respect your right to say it, but you're definitely getting the boot if you insult me. Now, except this guy here, you can see uh, Tyler Thorne. What a lazy POS. If you're not going to do something properly, don't do it at all, he says. Thank you, Tyler Thorne, for the advice. And I appreciate the comment. I thought this one was derogatory, but then I saw that lazy meant minimal work. And POS actually meant perfect over fence solution. And the zip ties, the poor zip ties, got hammered for being used on this fence. Viewers saying they would rather use duct tape super glue bondo and a number of other substances rather than zip ties never underestimate the zip tie my friend the point is look at all these haters about an idea that worked well with minimal cost the solution was under 200 bucks and still up seven years later sounds like it was well worth it keep doing what you're doing people there will always be haters out there but there'll be 10 times the amount of people that like you the zip ties are intact, the fence is not blown over, and it is a ripened plum. So awesome seven year lesson. Hey man, just because it's not the conventional way doesn't mean it won't work. Hey, maybe it was redneck, but a kick. I say all the negative comments were just awesome. I had such a good time reading them, you're hilarious. Now, the video has got like two and a half million views. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Leave a negative comment. That would be amazing. So for Home Ender, I'm Dustin. I hope you learned something today. And if you did, don't forget to click subscribe. Thanks for watching. I like that.